So a lot of us are going to be turning up the heat right the next couple of days. If you haven't already, the colder weather on the way, it's likely going to cost more to heat up your home thanks to a spike in energy prices as well. Can closing some of your vents help you save on the bill? Hmm? Brandon Lewis verifies. The Energy Information Administration expects heating bills could jump nearly 30% this winter for some homeowners because of an increase in wholesale energy prices. So people are willing to try almost anything to keep costs down. One common thought is by closing the vents in unused rooms in your home, you can force the warm air into occupied rooms and avoid paying to heat empty rooms. So let's verify. Is closing vents in unused rooms a reliable way to save money on heating costs? Our sources are two HVAC companies, Energy Vanguard, which trains energy auditors, renewable energy company Prime Energy, and Ian Walker with the International HVAC Engineering Society, ASHRAE. All of our sources say completely closing vents is a bad idea because these systems are designed to flow air throughout your home. While you can partially close some vents in your home, when you totally shut vents in one room, you're actually blocking the flow, which can cause your system to use more energy as it tries to circulate the heat elsewhere. Closing vents can also build pressure in your system. This can strain it, which causes damage over time, and your ducts may leak heat. Plus, Apollo Home says the laws of physics can end up putting some of that heat into unused rooms anyway. Most interior walls don't have insulation, meaning the warm air will eventually seep into an adjacent colder room, again, negating any attempt at savings because your furnace will cycle on and off more frequently, raising your costs and lowering your comfort. So no, closing vents in unused rooms is not a reliable way to save money on heating costs. Any potential cost savings is outweighed by the inefficiency and could cost you more in repairs in the long run. With your Verify, I'm Brandon Lewis.